morning. Today we are playing Hogwarts Legacy. Oh, and we are playing <clears throat> Morgana. No, Elsa Le Fay. Yeah, descendant of Morgana Le Fay. Because why not? She's a Slytherin. And today, she starts her classes at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Falkenzor! To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity. Especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned. Starting with something small. Something small. No. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. As Master Pruitt said. So, now, the basic well done. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel. Using the Levioso, face it cast, and Protego. You may begin. This 
this should be easy. Potato. Complicates things. Good form. I know. This court is a perfect jewel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. If only all my students were today. I do. George, your life is just. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. Thank you, Professor Hecklett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelow's entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my God. That's, that's enough. enough. I hate to test for Hesperson's deal. Uh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Rebellion. Sebastian, he's strong competition. Well done. She's got normal skills. I don't know oh my god. She also has an ostrich. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone isn't talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again. Perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Oh, Fair enough. You are an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Can we? Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get... Oh, right. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or act. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the. Till next time. Oh,
I don't know what this is, too. Don't... Professor Roman tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the nest. Poppy. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Oh, fine. I guess I'll sit next to the rough door. Hello. I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charm. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am I have a house, so I think I like will take hold with a passion and rigor so requisite of, of such around. a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517, but before yeah, that's everything I think, and it's cool that Professor Weasley showed you, like, uh, a house where it go, color change but I feel like it should have had a house to do it, it anyone? anyone? Or not player, but different, you know, getting to meet the teacher, talk to the teacher, had a house that takes you underneath their wing, the my other stuff, I think it's a little too much. Just to say that you won't spend your holidays practicing oblivion. That is just a good job. It's just a great job, but like, do you know how to perform a basic summoning charm? Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now really? let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed for partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get me to place now. I get the place. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential, potential is nothing is without practice. practice. Keep, at, Keep it. at it. You might, might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, Very good everyone. everyone. That's, enough That's enough of that. that. Well, you all seem to have the basic down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day. I was thinking we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Going outside? What purpose could be held outside? so why don't we have our new students start us off?
Friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give a student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You did the pin just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, yes. Let us do this. There we go. Damn it. Not to worry. Not to worry. Oh, out. Oh. This one's going balls to the wall. Oh! <laughs> I just hope their balls would all go out. Rat. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Hey, people on drums. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. <laughs> okay. Stay enough, chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Let us see this. Yeah, you know, take this at all, are you? took us both out. Yeah. An imitation. Oh, my oh. stayed on, baby! Fifty points, baby! Yeah, oh! You just got stopped. I'll show you how it's done. And... Do not and... make any good. Oh! No! Oh, oh hey! Oh! Man! Damn it! What is that your follow-up? But I'm following off. She won again. Very good, both of you. Well done. Drat. I didn't think it would go negative fifty on me. That sucks. I want to kick her ball off. Well, guess that was happening when someone tossed the cheese. She's a respire. Well done, well done, back then. You took you the loss in stride. stride. Didn't want didn't to go to too easy. easy. Took, me took me weeks, weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took, took weeks for weeks me to get anything right when I transferred here. It, it gets easier, easier, I promise. Thank you, Thank but you. I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach the nation here. Before I met, I had left the with and to halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. 
She doesn't care about that stuff. Yeah, I don't think she does. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not to be careful. Him too next time. Of course, you can use Akion's A word if you're so inclined. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Bastion. You know it won't work on human. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I did. I trust, I trust your first charm has lived, 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 lived up to expectation. Well, well in our dog competition, it wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting to. What charm is there in this expected? Miss O'Neill is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss O'Neill is always a fierce competitor. No, I I on that last be one. Distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary. Like now, I not burn my balls off, but like I am not going to my out. I am preparing kind of for you. Professor Rowan reminds, reminds me of my, my grandfather. grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a little more. Anna Huff, Anna Griffin Nor. Doing a little extra work. It was constant everywhere. Quite Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. No, well, it's been going something, all right. Stick him up, buddy. Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, no, no, ever since my time work, I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. It was Basil Flack. Basil Flack. I think I would have asked if it was the Minister of Boots or the Minister of Flack. Stop it. That is a minister and no one gives a fuck. Okay, let's go check out our gear. We got some new gear. We got some new shades. Which the shoes is gonna wear?
rebellion. What are you up to now? your business. An hour. Rebellion. Oh, there's that one. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's I don't think they should do some yet. But she thought they were pretty interesting.
Blue powder is pretty neat. Oh, snap. He was assigned to me. Well, that's interesting. Lumos. Five-headed ostrich. That's one. Word. Don't get yes, too cocky yes, simply yes, because yes, you had yes, one victory yes, over Salad. Yes. He never backs down from the fight. Yeah. What about you? You backed down from the fight. Be careful, won't you? I know that place. Because you had one victory over Salo. He never backs down from the fight. Sitting next to the Griffith Arms doing it.
forget what that Hufflepuff girl said in 1421. Oh, that's class, that is. That's a trust. A dark wizard. Moments, the advanced test. Would be sure to tell him how very much you should talk. It's a cat. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing. The room! Perhaps you could help. Oh, oh. Uh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me. Ah, there you are. Here I am. Scars and all. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels oh, wow. here than what you've told me. This has been 414 that? days as the Continental Champion. Alright, Macho Man Randy Savage. That's kind of awesome. I think they're gonna do it. I think it'd be kinda of cool if he breaks the rain. Got no story one is going on or anything, so it kinda of works out. He continues to be reticent about the details. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumo? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonic from a stream. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost yeah, from your Hogsmeade. Head, including seeds, Potion recipes and spellcraft. Let's go. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your oh, classes really well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village yep. with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I think I'll go with my fellow Slytherin. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to have you. I Mr. Sallow know. is a capable young wizard. Fellow Slytherins. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. 
Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Cup. <laughs> run, Weasley. I mean, that's a tip of run, Weasley, man. Anyone who thinks different is dumb, dumb. Ooh, a fedora. We got the old wardrobes. Hat. I'm a hat. I'm a stylish hat. Professor? Indeed I do, yes. and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. See you too. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Brilliant. I got the magic in me. Everywhere I turn, I've got I the magic. I can make it in silence, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Did it, 
And That's now it. I can Very good. repair If you would like to practice stuff. mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. It's like magic. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? Distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha can probably are. Yeah, but it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I, I do, so. an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been I racking my brains long enough. I, I you know what it's all about. I've. No, this is the same one I found. Illuminating that solves the mystery. Yeah, illuminating. Oh look. I should be fine. It's nearby. Nine hundred page. Yeah. I think I was close to it. My smell must have wrapped around. This looks like the location of the painting. Oh. What would be so special about? Maybe it was that statue. Oh wait. Uh, it's the mark. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. I was told I saw the weeks ago. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. And I'm not gonna tell her how to do it. Hey, Lenora. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I'm not I'm telling. I can't tell you. <laughs> Surely you jest. <laughs> you should no. have worked it out on your own. You have nerve. Especially since I'm the one who told you about it in the first place. <laughs> Imagine solving a riddle that I mentioned and then not telling me the answer. Well, uh, yeah. Competing with an elder to see who's the more infuriating know-it-all. Yeah, well, me and Molly has to care. We're Slytherins. Another door. I'm just doing this because why not? She's a Slytherin. She's pretty smart. Well, you know, if I was only gonna do with the Rainbow Cloud, but I don't give a fuck anymore. I'll do them probably as each student. Maybe.
page. Ow! Hit me in the face. today quests okay so I'm going to go for the I really oh. have made a mess of things <laughs> is everything all right oh Hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use Early in my library. Charm, books. Man, you think my be arms a are so ball. tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. That sounds a rather complicated way to simply avoid carrying your books. Possibly. But where's the fun in simplicity? New charms and spells have to come from someone. Why not me? I collect the books and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Perhaps I could. I suppose I could help if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Okay. I guess I got a uh, Gryffindor out. Why not? Sesame. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Got it. I need four more to go. Ah, I got it. This must be Cressida's diary. <laughs> I'd read this book too if I were her. She's very judgy.
Lumos. I know that painting. I don't leave the library when I'm getting ready to leave the library. Soon be heading to the hall. What's up, my fellow students? Check the general study room. Must be nice. I collected your books, including your diary. Yeah, oh, and I'm ready. And you're a meanie. You. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Uh, perhaps a reward to keep the diary a secret. Unless you want your classmates to know how you really feel about them, you might reward me for my time. Oh, you're not at all who I thought you to be. <laughs> I actually, I actually nailed that. I didn't think I was gonna nail that. It was, it was Coach from Letterkenny. We was a little weird laugh in a couple episodes and um, later on this season. I'm only joking, but I'm not. And you're not. You may have like a Ravenclaw or something. Based upon your diary, you seem terribly judgmental. Fine, I shall pay you. But you cannot begin to imagine yeah, what I shall be writing about <clears throat> you next. Oh, well, I am sorry I was going to read it. Next. <laughs> Poor Gryffindor cry, baby. You gonna cry, Gryffindor? Cry. I mentioned, and then not telling me the answer. Practically competing with a Melda to see who's a more infuriating know-it-all. Well, maybe you should have figured it out. I'm doing you a favor. Lenora. So you could figure it out yourself. I can tell you how to figure it, dude. I'll figure it, dude. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong way. Dust, tell her to figure it, dude. Oh, 
Oh, wrong way. Dang it. I have to go this way. Lumos. Well, fancy meeting you here. Revelio. Yeah, we're not going to hog me that. That'll be a separate video. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Southern Common Room. The home of Salazar Slytherin, the ostrich fucker. And I say that because we were literally in this common room, and there it is, an ostrich, in a case. Rumor has it, this is the ostrich that Salazar Slytherin thought somehow. What do you mean you're not a fan of your common room? And then I can't concentrate, so I end up just talking to everyone and nothing gets done. Well, that's your own damn fault. Maybe you should have been sorting to slow there and have some respect. Professor Sharp asked me what the ingredients are for an alley hotsy draft, and I could not stop giggling. Most embarrassing. And appropriate, I suppose. My mother sends the foulest owls. I'm talking about the actual owls. I'm convinced yeah. I've been Does she? Hey man, this is where they were hanging out when they were talking to Malfoy because the stairs were in the background Harry and Ron were sitting right here. I'm pretty sure at least. Yeah, these are the, these are the chairs. This is the area. Let's 
Let's change it up. Gears. If you want to hide her scar, she could wear that. That'd be cool. Kind of like... I don't feel like showing my man my, my scar. My face. Oh, field guide pages. Ooh, like a regalia. Regalia hat. Set all set. Crossed ones. I guess we can get across ones. The secret dueling club. Because, like, the last thing we're going to do for, like, the southern character is, like, we're going to. You know, we're gonna do the thing, and that thing being, you know, like Hogsmeade, and then we'll get back to playing um, Hufflepuff. And then we'll go to Hufflepuff to, to their second trial, and then we'll come back to Slytherin, and go all the way to their first trial. And then, after that, after her first trial, that's when we'll start her. Go, go, Gryffindor. Go, go, Gryffindor. On normal mode. Or maybe we'll switch it up. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe, like, Ravenclaw will be, like, normal mode. I feel like Ravenclaw's would like a challenge though, like to really test out their smarts and their wits and whatnot. Then Gryffindor's also too. Because of like the challenge. Uh. What the Fell off the thing. <laughs> that would have been funny.
rebellion. Live and breathe. No Raven Claw common room. Is so smart. S M Marty. Oh, glitch that cool. I usually find that sometimes somewhere else. All right, we got new glasses that suck. Keep lying on the staircases. They like to change. Oh, there's doors this area now. There wasn't doors in the last area. Lady. 
port of God, the Griffin Hall common room, requiring a passport for many who wish to enter. She and her friend Violet are known to wander among the portraits, periodically helping themselves a vest of wine in there. But why is she called that family? Like, what's her actual name? I found two more common rooms. Dueling lost rather gamely. Yeah. That is that way, dude. Oh, you are too kind. We thank you. Please hold your applause. Let's go. And then again, I guess some um, girlfriends would like things to be more easier for them. I keep your name as Ronald Weasley. You need to see Harry Potter like, like it. learning his just part of this big world. <laughs> yes. I think Harry would want to learn all that he could instead of being shocked and surprised every single time something new happens. What up, my guy? Hey, I know him. I know his punk ass. Can I help you? No. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you. That's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you might really impress Sebastian. I did take him down peg. For dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does crossed ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And, to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along, or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in Let's the ring. Let's do it. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! It's not about getting in the ring. It's not really a ring, but still. We'll make you regret signing up. You want people to be part of your old dueling club. Take that. 
Hit him while they're down. Hit him while they're down in the cooch. I could never duel like that. Dang. She showed him no mercy. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up, and you could be the next new champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. How do y'all like getting school? Yeah, I took y'all to school. I took y'all to school and then some. Next time you need a partner for Cross Swans, don't hesitate to call on me. No problem. I feel sorry for your next opponent. Yeah, you want to join my league? Just wait till I've grown a bit, then we'll see how well you do. Yeah, you like that cop and old Gryffindor? The Gryffindor the lower hallway. Just here again. That's what the movies are missing. As They're missing keys. This hallway in the PS5 version is not enclosed. This one is how interesting. That will make it up for this video. We got a lot done in this video. Next video will be coming shortly. It's where we will go to Hogsmeade. So hit that like and share and subscribe buttons and See you next time.